Visual. As you just saw, audio visual, my last 2.1 level is out. Well, it is out. It's not out at the time of recording this, but it's now out for you guys. Uh, and I'm just gonna do a little bit of a developer's commentary on it, you know? Talk about the building process of the level, my mindset going into it, stuff like that. Should be a great time. This is audio visual using holographic by Kawhi Sprite. Banger song. Absolutely goaded song. And I built it in about three weeks, which is middle of the road for about how long it normally takes me to make levels these days my whole goal with building this level was for it to just kind of be like a culmination of everything i've learned throughout the 2.1 update right as a creator so i wasn't trying to make it my best level or anything but i think i still succeeded in making it pretty cool i'm very excited to be releasing it though because it's been it feels like it's been forever since i started this level but it's finally out now i try to still keep like a speed building mindset because obviously when i started it i thought 2.2 was going to be out in october which it <laughs> It was not, but that's fine. Uh, but I still wanted to make it good. And we got the outro. Uh, obviously, this level is dedicated to all my inspirations. Got that sick screen with my custom font I'm really proud of. Without further ado, let's just get into the developer commentary. How about that? The first couple parts in this level uh, were the easiest to make, I think, because I was just throwing stuff together. I had so many ideas for a level like this, right? And I was just, I was ready to start putting stuff together, right? So, you know, I threw together stars hanging from the ceiling, 2.0 background, I guess. It was pretty fun when I first started building that's just throwing stuff together right and that that kind of applies to the second part as well although this one was a little bit harder it, it went through a lot of design changes i'll put it that way and obviously the duel there's not much to say about it although i still think that it's probably one of the best looking things i've ever made i'm a bit tired of it now because i've seen it so many times but nonetheless i still think it's really cool this ball part i made on a stream where i was not at all in the mood to create which i would say hindered the quality which i think it kind of does but honestly i still think it turned out pretty good i just think it's a bit uh generic for my style this reverse wave is kind of where i started to slow down a little bit when creating just because i had a lot of stuff going on uh when i was making it which is a little tragic so this part i think took the longest i think it turned out all right i definitely had some hardships while uh creating it it took a lot of just individual things here and there, putting those things together and making it look good. And I'm still kind of iffy on some parts, like that little segment is weird, but it's fine. I think overall it turned out pretty cool. Jumping straight into the next part, uh, Alicia, about a week before I made this part, released a tutorial on her channel on how to make a scaling and rotating effect. So I was like, all right, you know what? I'm feeling inspired. I'll try to do that. So I did do it and I think it turned out pretty cool. All right, here's this part. This is another part that kind of struggled with the same syndrome of like, I was never really happy with it. I just kept adding stuff and praying that it would look good. Like everything on its own, I'm not too happy with. And I still think it looked good. I think I'm just tired of looking at it. So that could also be the case. And then we have this part. Originally, I was gonna have the level end right there, but then it would have only been like, uh, I think it was almost under a minute. And also when I, st when I started building this part, 2.2 uh, .2 had already been delayed. So I had, I had a little bit more time to work on stuff I wanted to. So I decided to extend it. And I'm so glad I did. 
honestly not much to say about this part in general it's a pretty simple part rather straightforward i built it in a day by the way like that's actually kind of crazy i got out of my weird mindset from the uh previous two parts and i just went crazy and built a whole part in a day so i guess that's good and then of course we have the iconic <laughs> ice spice part which is so funny it's so stupid just having ice spice show up in your level but there is nothing on this earth that could ever make me take her out of this level because it is my favorite part my favorite part of creating is just adding a bunch of dumb garbage like that in my level like it makes it it makes creating so much fun like oh yeah level that takes itself somewhat seriously nope too bad ice spice the outro was 12 percent of the level which is a bit lengthy but the level is going to end there anyways and it was already like a minute and 30 seconds long so i think it's fine uh the outro just dedicates it to all my inspirations you know because so i think if you know a lot of creators in geom trash i think you'd be able to see the influence of a lot of other creators in my style you know and i think that's a cool thing i love being inspired and being able to inspire other people you know also this is my first level with three coins which is kind of interesting also by the way might i mention i made this font myself i'm so proud of that i don't know if i'll ever release it uh <laughs> i'm feeling kind of gaslight gatekeep girl boss for this one i'm not gonna lie to you overall obviously the jf influence is real jf is my biggest inspiration hence why they were listed first in the list of dedications like i was saying this level was just like it's kind of a for fun project right i wanted something representative of who i was as a creator and i think this level is very much that like if you look at this level it is this is audio visual this is me dude this is me at my at my most me if that makes any sense at the end of the day i definitely think i achieved what i was aiming for with this level i had tricipital play test this part last night and they said it was mid <laughs> so this part might look a little bit different uh when the level comes out because i might add some stuff or like polish some stuff up but yeah that's about it this level is finally done and i'm happy to finally be able to share it with all you guys so go play it you know go check it out yeah, you know what? I think that's just about all I got to say. Thank you guys so much for watching this developer's commentary on audiovisual. And with that being said... Stop scrolling right now to obtain audiovisual cables. Repeat these numbers. 960 Bye.